Hello and welcome to 5-Minute Math. Today we are looking at the fourth grade concept of modeling and division. This is standard 4.4e in the great state of Texas and we are using item number 24 off the redesign practice online star test. If you haven't done so already, please go ahead and take a moment to pause the video, work this problem out on your own, unpause it, and we will look at our answers together. So a family drives, plans to drive 1,584 miles in four days. The family will drive the same number of miles in each day, which equation could be used to find the number of miles they will drive each day. So let's open up our graph draw feature. We're going to expand it out using those diagonal arrows. We're going to make it a little bit more transparent so we can see what's going on behind there. We'll click draw here. So we've got two numbers, right? We've got this 1584 and the 4. Take a look at our answer selections. And they already give us the answers. They don't want us to figure out what 1584 plus 4 is or minus 4 times 4 divided by 4. They give us the answers. We just need to figure out which operation is going to be the one we use because we could add, subtract, multiply, or divide. There is one key term that I want to underline in blue here the same number of miles each day. Uh, that's very important. Same number of miles and then even this word each. We're going to see that a lot, a lot, a lot. When you see the same number of miles, the same number in each box, the same number in each group, it doesn't matter how they describe the groups, when they are equal groups, that gives us two options here that are most likely going to be the ones we need. Multiplication or division. This word each always shows up a lot in multiplication and division because each means each individual group. So let's see if we could put this in a strip diagram here. So plans to drive 1,584. All right, so this to me sounds like a total. All right, so I'm going to kind of do this right here. So 1,584. That's as far as they plan to drive. So we're not getting more than that. We're not getting uh, less than that. So they're going to do that in four days. Now look what happens if I wanted to do multiplication or division, right? It would kind of change our strip, strip diagram. So if I wanted to divide it, I can actually keep it like this, right? I could take my 1584, I could divide it into four equal days, and they said it was, what, 396 each. So 396, 396, 396, 396. All right, so here I can, I can see is 1584 divided by four, equals 396, all right, so that's what this represents. I could do 4 times 396 equals 1584. So that was one option if I chose this division option. Check what happens if I choose the multiplication option. And then suddenly my 1584 doesn't become the total. The way they've got this right here on B is that what you're going to do is you are going to have a new total and you're going to have four sets of 1584. 1584, 1584, so basically 1584 times 4. And they actually give us our new total. That's 6,336. That's a problem because our total is this 1584. And so even though this uses the 1584, it multiplies it by 4, it gets us a new total. And the equation is supposed to use the number of miles the family would drive each day. Well, that doesn't make any sense to drive 6,336 miles each day. It doesn't make sense to drive 1580 miles each day or 1588 miles each day. The total is 1584. So we're going to need to split that up into four equal groups. And our answer here is going to be C.